Smelly drive through downtown today. A semi truck spilled pig intestines all along 670. KCTV 5 Savannah Rudisell joins us now with a look at the cleanup effort. As if the morning commute wasn't frustrating enough, let's add pig guts. MoDOT and fire crews were still cleaning up intestines hours after they splashed across three lanes of traffic on I-670. Drivers said it was one of the grossest things they'd ever seen. Piles of animal product littered the highway for hours. People walking around downtown this afternoon saw and smelled what was left of the spilled pig intestines along I-670. It made me gag the first time I, I smelled it. It's pretty pungent with a little twang to it. It's, 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 it's foul. <laughs> we showed them the scene from just hours before. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. I didn't realize it was like that. From Chopper 5, you can see the mess stretched out a few hundred feet. From the ground, you can see it all up close. The viewer who sent this to us says the road might be a greasy mess for a while. He knows this because he's a butcher. Police say they don't know how the gut spilled out of the trailer, but there wasn't a wreck. I live in Northwest Pennsylvania, so I'm used to seeing them plow snow, but not pig intestines. So how did crews try to cut the mess and the smell? Sawdust and powdered soap. It helped, but we found out firsthand it wasn't a perfect solution. Be glad you can't smell through your TV tonight. MoDOT says the traffic backup was at least three miles long down I-70 this morning. You can see more of the video caught by Chopper 5 this morning on KCTV5's Facebook page. Reporting in Kansas City, Savannah Rudisell, KCTV5 News. Just nasty. Now, if you're wondering where all that spillage went, MoDOT says the company transporting the load came back to shovel it away. They also provided the powdered soap used to clean up that grease.